Okay, welcome to a review of one of my favorite series in the game ever. <clears throat> Sorry if I go <clears throat> a lot and I have a runny nose. So, yeah. Sorry about that. So this is my favorite series ever, Assassin's Creed. So I'm just going to jump into this, sorry if it lags a little bit, but yeah, I'm just going to jump into this, and um, <clears throat> yeah, my review. Um, if I stutter a bit like I just did, that's because I don't really know what to say. Hold on my ear, it just... Okay, good. <clears throat> Why is it taking so long to load? Yeah. This is a nice bit in the game where you can just jump around and stuff. Oh, you're waiting. Okay, so, this is the game. You have weapons. <clears throat> the main part of, the, of this game is the hook blade. It will help you wherever you go. Like, normally, I wouldn't be able to climb up to there, but with the hook blade, I can. So, the hook blade... So the hook blade is a big part of this game, <clears throat> and I love it. Plus, how the series is going to work is I'm going to play a bit of this game. I've beaten the game, so, yeah. So, I love it for that, and it's going to be a 0 <clears throat> of 10, um, type of rating, not like a one to five, but yeah, more accurate. So, if you have this game, congrats! I hope you love it. Because if you don't, well, you don't know what gaming is. And I just broke some of my armor. And that's a nice feature. Do this game. Armor does not stay forever. You can break it. Well, it does stay forever. <clears throat> you can break it and you have to go repair it. Even when you're hurt, you can repair it. So that it's a type of healing system in the game. And here we go. Now I'm going to show you another great game mechanic. <clears throat> in the first, they didn't have this in some of the games, so congrats to Ubisoft for making this. No! Aw, oh, come on. <clears throat> and the hook blade does allow you to jump. As in Assassin's Creed 2 in Brotherhood. Assassin's Creed 2, you needed to be taught that skill. <clears throat> in Da Vinci, in Brotherhood, you needed to, um, you needed to be taught it into. I forgot where it's at. Sorry. So, yeah. You can zip line in this game. And if there's a guard under you, you can assassinate them. And here's a type of assassinating. The combat system, it's pretty nice. How do they? Uh, the AI is not something that, that's great. What? Oh yeah, I pressed that button. There's also a button to call your assassins, which is the bar I will put an annotation on right here. 
Yeah, that bar with crossbow and red. <clears throat> Arrows. Oh yeah, if you want me to do the multiplayer, multiplayer is kind of nice if anybody's on it. They have some good. <clears throat> um, sorry. They have a lot of good. And I'm not saying like it's a bad thing. They have a lot of really good um, death matches and how the leveling up gives you advantages. I don't like that. It's like Call of Duty. And I kind of like Call of Duty, actually. I have Modern Warfare 2. I'm sorry, am I bothering you? Hope I won't be bothering you anymore. Yeah. I don't know what I should rate it. I think I'll let the comments decide. Nah, I'll just rate it myself. <clears throat> but you can rate it yourself down in the comments below and have like a war. If you want to, but me. Nee. <clears throat> um, I'm not gonna do that. Hi there! Hi! 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 Hey! You have a problem with me? You have a problem with me? Yeah? Don't anymore? And assassinations. You can do so many of them. Like, as this white here will be and not a uh, so main, but um, you will use it a lot. So you will just go run, 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 stab. Da da. Die, 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 die. You're dead. And you can pick up the enemy's bodies. And then throw them over. Get back up. And throw them. Yeah, so you can pick up their weapons too. And actually, how I got my first dagger was I took it off of a guard. The game doesn't um, do that in a scripted way. I just did it by myself. I got attacked, and I killed a guard, an agile guard. They have daggers and stuff. It's cool. Absolutely beyond my comprehension. But what I would like in Assassin's Creed 3, actually, is in the multiplayer, they would implement the, the combat system. Not just insta-kills when you walk up. Because, eh, cool animations, but you should be able to counter somebody trying to kill you. And hurt them. Yeah. So yeah. This was me and me saying like the game mechanics and stuff. So um, at the end of the video I will make another video of this video it will be included I will say like I rate this game a number out of 10 yeah so currently I have the best weapon in the game the use of Turkish Kajil these. <laughs>
Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So it has all stats. Oh. And stuff. Ooh. That's a nice one. Ooh. Where is it? Um, I th think it was that one. Oh no, it was this one that I got first off of a guard. Ooh, this one's really nice. I will take it. Thank you. Yeah, so in Brotherhood and the Brotherhood and this game, you have to buy your crossbow. And those are the only two games with crossbows. So, what do you want from me? Yeah, so it's good to always, when you come to the, when you come to the store to just buy everything you can. Yeah. This game has some really brutal kills. Not gonna lie, when I first saw them, I was like, ooh, oh god. Sorry if it goes Because it's kind of close to my face. Here, I'll put it away a bit. Okay, hope that's better. So yeah, if I could find a good outro, um, I will do it. Yeah, so this was me. I will for the win studios. <coughs> Signing off. See ya. Ah! Hello there, guys. Um, I rate Assassin's Creed Revelations an 8 out of 10. It is a pretty good game. Some things could have been implemented and fixed. But, officially, it's an 8 out of 10. I love the game. You should go out and buy it right now, actually. You will enjoy it if you like a platforming stealth um, game. You should at least play the entire series to get um up to date on the story so you know a lot of it so that 